Epic rap battles of my ass. Emperor Palpatine. Versus Caligula. Oh, begin. Did you ever hear the tragedy of a fool named Caligula? By far the biggest tool to ever rule this peninsula. Ha <laughs> ha, I'm Palpatine creating schemes behind the scenes. It's like holographic chess, the way I play my knights and queens. Fun both sides of the Clone Wars and cut ties with the Separatists. Your grand plan can be summarized as see something, have sex with it. Yeah. My politics are nothing less than iconic. Your complete saga is utterly ironic. A child nicknamed Little Boots by dressing like the troops. But then your military career went down the trash compact to shoot. You tried invading Britannia, which was downright bonkers. Your sister's womb the only thing you successfully conquered. What is it with the freaky love lives of my enemies? I'm known to dish our shock treatment for incestuous tendencies, so you'd better watch your tongue unless you're looking for a zap. I'll see you in round two when the Emperor strikes back. You want to duel of fate? <laughs> well, for starters, as far as wizards go, the sorcerers got less stones than Harry Potter. Well, I led my adversaries like lambs to the slaughter. That verse was written so poorly I thought it was your granddaughter. Well, first year on the throne, I was a savior to Rome. They got on their knees and screamed as they hailed the new hope. Then after falling ill, I snapped. And I took a 180 And the citizens cried out Caligula's crazy You see, because your lyrical torture has just begun Your ghoulish face outweighs the horrors I endured on Caprice so I acquired a taste for throwing people off cliffs Like when your so-called sidekick tossed you into the abyss Oh kook, you're delirious My raps are imperious I smother elderly freaks in their sleep As Tiberius Step out of the dark side You're as pale as a manic It's pretty clear the only grooming you do is creeping on Anakin This attack on my characters left me scarred and deformed Just like your mother and brother when they Starved on a dawn. They wanted me for the sequels. I said, fine, let's do it. Too bad Little Boots family couldn't also be rebooted. You executed Order 69. Not a thing you wouldn't screw. Getting with men and the women and the children, too. Now, I know that Italians have a thing for their pizza. But do you have to be so hot and ruddy, Little Caesar? You're not even worth pulling out my lightsaber. Maybe later you can try and take a swing against Vader. And yes, I am old, which means I've seen some things. He's just a boy. Right, so let's slay this young lady. You take people's wives and use the force. Many arms are sick as a Plagueis. Look like Zee Cell said, go and warn, I get why your real name is Gaius. You'll die at Palpatine Hill now, cause I'm ready to end it. This wasn't the first time a Caesar was killed by the Senate. Henceforth, let the state that the calendar marks be known as the Ides of Imperial March. Face it, Pleb, Rome's importance to your series is vital. From your very power grab to the numerals in your title. You had your wrinkly scowl in that cow, cause you're busted. My face is so chiseled, it's only natural to bust it. Your infrastructure sucks, it's built to self-destruct. I support my rapid flow by building ports and aqueducts. Your new blood, I'm akin to Jupiter and Venus Which explains why your whole reign was generally grievous You disregard the rule of two or multiple instances Discarding apprentices like I do with mistresses But I guess apprentice talks are something you want to get into Without your buddy there, you'd have been killed by Mace Windu Even your minions are hit or miss, it's pity You're no sovereign when Disney is the lord of Darth Sidious Boom, baby. I used to be selfish too, stepping on my footman. Then my buddy Pacha taught me how to be a good man. Now I'm the gold standard of turning over a new leaf. Let's see what you can learn from Disney's most comedic movie. Yeah. Tackle again and I'll mess up your eye. Worse than the first cut of episode five. Hate to focus on your looks, but they're so easy to diss. I mean, dude, you look like Yzma, just with sacky and tits. I got turned into livestock, and that was pretty awful. But if I drank a horse potion, I guess you would have made me consul. And you're a Trojan horse, because underneath this phony facade of living God, you're just the world's first bro. These two crotchety dudes don't got that emperor's groove I've got the moves to make Kronk say Oh yeah, Kronk approves Call it Cusco's poison, I got spades of disses This llama just spit all over both of you bitches